Hey, what's going on there? How y'all doing out there today? This is your Uncle Steve here in Uncle Steve's Lounge. Thank you for joining us. If you get a chance to, please hit the subscribe button so we can continue to bring you content into the new year about the 2023 Atlanta Falcons and everything they have going on. Also, don't forget to like the video after we're done. Today's topic we're going to talk about is about the head coach position. Now, I know a lot of folks don't want to give a lot of time for Arthur Smith to take this team to the next level. He had the first two years, 7 and 10, 7 and 10, and a lot of people are expecting success, which they should have with the upgraded offense they have. However, the one thing I have been a little bit interested in is why we aren't willing to give him this chance to prove himself in his third year. I think the first two years really weren't, it, it really wasn't his fault when you think about it. That first year, of course, we had Matt Ryan, who was basically on his last legs, as we see now with him kind of going into the booth this year for CBS. And this past year, the Marcus Mariota, uh, project. I think that was just a bridge to get to the 2023 season when we were able to open up our pocketbooks a little bit for the team to bring some elevated talent into this franchise. Now, Arthur Smith doesn't have anything to be ashamed of in this Atlanta Falcons franchise when it comes to coaching victories, because as we see, there isn't a lot of success when you think about the past. As a matter of fact, over the 66-year uh, time of this franchise, we've only had four coaches that have winning records. Uh, Mike Smith, Lehman Bennett, uh, Jim Mora, and Dan Quinn. That's it. Just, just four. So what is Arthur Smith going up against? He's going up a, of a history of coaches that haven't stuck around for the long run to have a sustained amount of success in this city. So Mike Smith right now is probably the gold standard when, you, when it comes to coaching in the Atlanta Falcons. He has 66 franchise victories. He took the team to the playoffs five times, albeit – only one playoff win. That was the win in 2012 to get us to the NFC Championship game. Uh, Dan Reese, of course, is second. Uh, took us to the Super Bowl, uh, only to lose to his former team, Denver, that year. Uh, he did have a nice uh, playoff run that particular year uh, with three, uh, two wins that particular season. And he also came back and took Mike Vick in 2002 to the playoffs uh, the year that we beat Green Bay at Lambeau Field, first time they had ever lost a game there. Dan Quinn, of course, took us to the Super Bowl. Fantastic run. Actually, a fantastic back-to-back -back seasons in 2016 and 17. However, uh, all the rah-rah and popping circumstances kind of died down, and Dan Quinn kind of morphed back into uh, his D.C. role, which he is now flourishing in over at Dallas. And believe it or not, the only other coach with a winning record, and because he wasn't here quite that long, is Jim Mora, Mr. Dream Job in University of Washington, uh, stuck around long enough to ride Mike Vick to that 11-5 uh, uh, and five season back in 2004. So Arthur Smith currently even with the two back-to-back -back losing seasons is number 11 of 18 coaches in franchise history already. If we have a special year, he has an opportunity to pass stalwarts like June Jones and Dan Henning and jump into eighth place. If he has a super special season, he could actually catch a Jim Moore, meaning 12 wins or more. So as far as Arthur Smith is concerned, I think we need to give him just a little bit of break. This is the first time that We've been able to go out and get some veteran help for this team. He's had a couple of years to install the offense that he wants. He's gone out in the draft and got uh, B. John Robinson. Uh, hopefully, we're, we're hoping to be a great offensive guard 
and Matthew Bergeron and some other pieces around the defense to help solidify things on the other side of the ball. So as far as I'm concerned, I really do feel like this is the year that Arthur Smith should be able to prove to Atlanta fans that he is the coach for the now for our team. This is your up talking to you. I hope everyone enjoyed the video. We will catch you guys later on. Please don't forget, subscribe, like the video, and we'll catch you later on on Uncle Steve's Lounge. <music>